sing a song together to start the show. What song? Welcome to Mandatory Update. The show, the show you love to watch. watch. That's not true. <laughs> <laughs> The next Nintendo Direct coming May 7th will have a huge focus on Splatoon. You can also expect plenty of Star Wars content coming as it does on the fabled most Star Wars of days, May the 7th. <laughs> Newly released cover art for Halo 5 Guardians shows Master Chief head to head with Spartan Locke as legions of Spartan soldiers chant, kiss, kiss. Arkham Knight's $40 season pass offers players DLC staggered over six months following the game's release, meaning that it will cost you $100 to play all of the game's content. There's a premium edition that includes the game and season pass for $99.99. Well, as Paul Giamatti said as John Adams, a penny saved is a penny earned. After comments by Guillermo del Toro and principal actor Norman Reedus, Konami has confirmed that the Silent Hills game being helmed by Hideo Kojima and del Toro is cancelled. Bullshit! A statement given to Polygon explained that Konami is committed to new Silent Hills titles, however the embryonic Silent Hills project developed with del Toro and featuring the likeness of Norman Reedus will not be continued. Here to comment on the cancellation of Silent Hills is the PT Sync Baby. Sync Baby, thank you so much for joining us via satellite today. I'll take any opportunity to get out of the sink, which I am still, in fact, in. Of course, uh, Sink Baby, so uh, Silent Hills is no longer happening, and consequently, you're no longer in it. What went wrong? What, what happened to the game? The hills are too quiet. Nobody could find them. We had to cancel. Uh, really? We heard that the breakdown between Kojima and Konami was the catalyst there. Nah, it's them mountains. I know what you're thinking. Losing a mountain? That's crazy. But it happens. I see. Uh, what's the climate like over at Konami? Do you still see Hideo Kojima around the office? Are people having trouble with him being there? Hideo Kojima having trouble with himself. That motherfucker painted the mark of Aquarius on his forehead and he's walking through the office in a sequin robe screaming that he's the Castlevania Lord of Shadow! Where's Guillermo del Toro while this is all happening? Ah, he mostly hanging out at the set of Star Wars. I said, Del Toro, that's not your movie! I said it the second Star Wars was announced. I said, Silent Hills is doomed! I have to say, the course of this project and the eventual outcome have been really disappointing. Um, but where will your career go next, Sink Baby? What does this mean now for you? Oh, these are terrible times for Sink Baby! But Sink Baby always lands on his feet. Well, not really. I don't know how to walk yet. I also haven't developed eyes! Are you still there? I can't see! Yes, but wait, if you can't see, how do you know what Hideo Kojima looks like? I got the damn devil in me! Right, uh, well, unfortunately, it seems like that's all the time we have, Sink Baby. Yeah. Um, we're sorry to hear about Silent Hills, but hopefully this doesn't mean the end of your career in the games industry. Yeah. Oh yeah! I'm working on some paid mods for Skyrim, so don't worry about Sink Baby! Hey, have you seen my mom? Nah, but don't worry, I have a feeling she'll pop up. The animatronic furries that terrorize Freddy Fazbear's Pizza will get one last scare in a fourth and final installment called Five Nights at Freddy's 4 Final Chapter, slated for release this Halloween. Look, if you're scared by a big giant bear with razor sharp teeth that wants to kill you, then I'm sorry, but you can't come to my orgy. Well, that's too bad. Yeah, it's gonna be pretty fun. It's a uh, Georgie Porgy orgy. Will there be pudding there? In a sense. The people who made Banjo-Kazooie are remaking Banjo-Kazooie with slightly different characters. Uh. First person World War I shooter game Verdun launched last week on Steam to a positive reception from fans and critics alike. The game's so realistic that I even developed a case of trench foot while playing. No, 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 no. You had that trench foot long before you played this game. I know. You live with your shame. Live with it. And use your cream for your trench foot. It burns my eyes. Don't put it in your eyes. Put it on your foot. But my eyes, I no. need to see. Yeah, the, don't put the trench foot ointment in your eyes and you'll see just fine. I can't see with the cream on my foot. What? <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Only days after launching paid mods on Steam, Valve abruptly canceled the payment option and vowed to refund Steam users who purchased Skyrim mods. Valve claims this is a reaction to fan feedback. Well, Valve, maybe if you didn't have the fans in front of the speakers, you wouldn't be getting so much feedback in the first place. Did you ever think of that? Ouya and its parent company are reportedly in talks to be sold. Apparently, e-commerce giant Alibaba expressed interest, but then passed on the deal to buy that $1,500 PS4 with PT on it instead. Julian Reese, a senior gameplay programmer on Watch Dogs, may have accidentally leaked confirmation of a sequel in development. His LinkedIn profile listed Watch Dogs, Watch Dogs 2, and Age of Adeline 2. Whoa, whoa, rewind here for a second. Is a potential sequel to the smash hit and critical success Age of Adeline in the works? It's hard to say, but Julian Reese might have something to do with it. Minecraft for consoles is getting a new playable default character skin, and she's a female! Her name is Alex, and she's Mojang's attempt to better represent the diversity of their player base. She has thinner arms, redder hair, and a ponytail. The coalition for skinny-armed, ginger, lazy, hairstyled ginger women couldn't be more enthused. Dead Island 2, the sequel to Deep Silver's Age of Adeline, has been delayed until 2016. The dev broke the news on Twitter, writing, We have always set ourselves a big goal for Dead Island 2, to create that sequel that takes Dead Island to the next level. We have been looking at the game long and hard, and we have decided we didn't reach that goal that we set out to achieve quite yet. In an attempt to do so, we are trying something crazy. We're gonna go for a dead isthmus. Who knows if we can pull it off, but we're gonna try it. Final Fantasy XV will have a short trailer at E3, but it won't be short enough. Microsoft has a brand new YouTube channel pimping the HoloLens, their augmented reality headset, and the company has confirmed that the tech will be showcased at E3. A playable demo will immerse players right dab smack in the middle of a massive games industry convention. Look, there's The Last Guardian. And there's Half-Life 3. Fiction can be fun. Ah. Anyway, that's the show. That's the show. That's the show. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Get that energy up. Tickle, tickle, tickle. <laughs> My girl wants to party, party all the time, party all the time, party all the time. Welcome to Mandatory Update. We are doing a special poll in the comments to see if Ian should shave his head. Oh! If you think yes, write yes. If you think no, write yes. Yeah. And if you think that I'm a mincing flock of seagulls hipster ladyboy, uh, well, you're already saying that, so just keep stay the course. Be yourself. Yeah. I checked out. Thanks. If I could chalk this show full of dicks, I would. Chalk dicks? Chalk them up. Screech. Dicks on a chalkboard. <laughs> <laughs> we should make sound. We should make a sound effects library, but it's all like sound effects nobody would ever need. <laughs> We're like, uh, dicks on a chalkboard. <laughs> <laughs> it's like what part of the dick is making that? Clinking noise. It's like a paper crane being torn apart. <laughs> <laughs> well, woman sobs in background. <laughs> You're done here. You're done here. Ah, only days after launching. Hang on. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Add that in the chamber. <laughs> Final Fantasy 15 will have a short trailer at E3, but it won't be short enough. <laughs> <laughs> the number one source for video game news, not here. Yeah. Probably go to IGN or Polygon or Kotaku or Joystick. Game Informer. Or Eurogamer or Joystick. Destructoid. Or Destructoid or Yahoo, Yahoo Games. Games. That's a good one. Uh, PC Gamer. Ooh, PC Gamer. Now we're talking. Now we're with gas. Uh, NeoGaf, talking with gas.com, reddit.com yeah. slash r slash gaming. Sometimes Back we issues just like of New York Game Pro. Times PSN has Magazine. PSM. Forbes has a, you know. Forbes does a lot of shit about stuff. Destiny. Pretty much every week they write something about yeah. Destiny. Uh, then you could go to game trailers after that. We should not include that. <laughs> Turtle doves! He mostly just hanging out on the set of Star Wars. I said Del Toto, that's not your movie. I said it the second Star Wars was announced. I said Silent Hills is doomed. <laughs>
Are you mostly hanging out at the set of Star Wars? I said, Del Toro, that's not your movie. I said it the second Star Wars was announced. I said, Silent Hills is doomed. <laughs> Note, we're mostly just doing this to amuse ourselves. <laughs>